The last phase of the swing that I want to talk about is our extension, follow through, and finish. A lot of hitting coaches really don't spend a lot of time talking about it, and I think it's one of the most important aspects of the swing. So we pick up the swing right at contact, and we want to see this good, long extension, long through the ball, and the hand starting to roll over at the very end. If you notice with Rich right here, his top hand came off the bat through follow through. This is totally okay. If you have a hitters that like to let go of their top hand and it helps them to feel that good long extension, that's totally okay. Some hitters like to hold on to the bat with two hands all the way through. Both of those things are okay. The things that I want you to really notice in his follow through, so go ahead and go follow through all the way again. Go through extension, follow through, and finish your turn. The most common phrase that I tell my hitters is, show me your back. If I'm sitting over here, I really want to see your entire back. If you have a jersey, I want to be able to see your name and number on the back of it. And I also tell them to make sure that, do it one more time, I'm going to point out one thing about your belly button. I, I want them to be able to say that they can put their belly button down the line or even in the batter's box or the on-deck circle over there. I want to be able to see this good, full turn with their body. And so you're going to hear me say a lot of things like finish your turn, finish your turn, show your belly button down the line. Those are great finishes. And this is a good finish. A lot of times we have hitters that get to about a three-quarter finish, and they never really get the full torso turn. And allowing that whole torso to turn allows us to get more power into the ball. One of the other things I want you to notice in her swing is how she gets her back foot unanchored. In the process of swinging, because she does a really good job of her hip drive and rotation, the back foot is going to naturally come off the ground and gain a little back ground as well. By allowing her back foot to unanchor from the ground, it allows her to finish her turn all the way. Most hitters who get stuck on their backside or their back foot gets stuck in the ground have a hard time finishing their turn. So let's see that finish right there. Great job. And you're going to see that her back foot got unanchored. It moved forward a little bit, allowing her to be able to finish and get a good full turn.